I came across this small application for FreeBSD called Gotti. It's either Gotti or GoTTY, I'm not quite sure. And what it apparently does, it enables you to view as a web application something that's running in the terminal. So I thought I'd give it a go. So I installed it on my Raspberry Pi running FreeBSD 13. And installation was relatively simple. I used PKG on the Raspberry Pi, but you could easily install from ports if you wish. And I'll choose to run HTOP. Now HTOP is HTOP, we all know that. And and here it is running in its own uh, terminal on the Raspberry Pi. So if I start Gotti and then specify the application afterwards, it comes up with this little message at the bottom saying server is starting with command line HTOP. So there it is, and it gives you little URLs that you can log into, IPv4 and IPv6, if you wish. There is the remote server IP and a local server IP, if you wish to just fire up a browser and have a look, see what's running. Although I don't really see the point of that, same as you're running in a uh, terminal on your own machine anyway. The real benefit to this comes when you log on to, say, for instance, my main machine, fire up a browser and point it towards a Raspberry Pi running the Gotti application, and you can see that... On the Raspberry Pi, as soon as I log in using the other machine, it should, there we go, it's uh, registering a client as uh, accessed. This is pretty cool. Although I'm running HTOP, you could run other ones. Um, I'm not quite sure what you would use it for or what would be useful in this situation, but it seems like a little little neat program. Uh, especially if you say, for instance, you're running a uh, little gaming server. You could watch the server messages fly up and down the screen if you wish. I can't, beyond this, really think of anything that I would use it for personally. It doesn't mean that there aren't other uses that I can, at the moment I can't think of. And uh, But it seems, seems a cool little program. And here are the uh, various options that you can use when you're using the command line. There are, of course, uh, security issues, and uh, these are addressed by the various options available. I just went for a very basic install and usage. But if you go to the main homepage, you can actually see, uh, it tells you everything you can put in, certificate values, etc. Your config file if you want to alter it, and there's a security options uh, which, which you really want to be using if you're if you this on a, uh, a long-term basis. So yes, it's very good, it's very cool. I don't remember seeing anything like this before, so I just thought I'd include it. And yes, uh, it's very much available for FreeBSD. With very easy installation. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll catch you next time.